you getting dressed soon, Quinn? I don't know. We gotta leave at four, so probably 3:30. Yes. Okay. Just to know that everyone really uh, supports me, and um, it just—it's very nice, and I'm very appreciative, and um, I'm, I'm just really happy to be able to have all my family here and have the support. See you, Benny. It's draft day. You gotta pull out the best Not stuff. Cool, I think. This is like something Quinn gave me too. So it's pretty nice. It's not wearing watches to school or anything, but like big events like this, I'm gonna wear a nice watch. Okay, I think we're ready to go. My biggest nightmare is tripping over the stairs and, and having my shirt untucked. <laughs> so when I take off my jacket, my, the back of my shirt just gets where, untucked where, where? too. Unreal to think that I left here as an 18-year-old and now I'm coming back with my 18-year-old for the NHL draft. The team that's licking their lips right now is Vancouver because they didn't think they'd get Quinn Hughes. I believe that's who they're going to take. For the fifth time, Jim Benning making his way to the podium as general manager of the Vancouver Canucks. Vancouver selects from the University of Michigan, Quinn Hughes. So proud of you, yeah, thanks, so bro. Proud of you. So happy. Yeah, thank you. So proud of you, buddy. Thanks, Mom. Congrats. Thanks. Yeah, thanks, Dad. Take your time, okay? Yeah, well. It's a great hockey market, and they got a lot of young talent coming up, so, you know, I'm just thrilled right now. I, I want to make an impact with the Vancouver Canucks, and they, they picked me seventh overall um, to do so. Welcome. Yeah, thank you. Awesome. Yeah, thank you. How's it going? I didn't think that was going to happen. Wow. <laughs> I didn't either, but I'm glad it did. Barget, thank you. Yeah, how you doing, man? Good. Hey, welcome aboard. Yeah, thank I'm you. I'm, I'm really excited. a lot of your hockey over in uh, Denmark. Yeah. yeah, so are you excited? Yeah, I'm thrilled. Yeah, yeah I know, I know. <laughs> I didn't know if I'd embarrass you by having there. <laughs> hey, I was thinking about it. I was at the hospital when Quinn was born, but, um, you know, that's really a coincidental side piece. Obviously, this is a business where we're trying to draft the best players we can and without question we felt like this was the the best player there at that spot. I was very excited to get Quinn Hughes. He's uh, he's a dynamic skater. Um, he's a skilled player. He's fun to watch. We didn't think he was going to be there for us at seven and the fact that he made it to seven and he's a defenseman and he's a, he's a power play guy would fit all of our needs. That's not to chuckle is it? <laughs> what up bro? Those all uh, family? Yeah, I got I got a lot of people here, bro. No, you text me. Oh, okay. you just do it, man. It's not too hard to ask. What do you mean you're not using your phone? You you live on your phone. I haven't looked. This is the first time, so. How many texts do you have? 95. My math teacher, Ellen Banta. <laughs> yeah, you know, shout out to her. Seriously though, she got me through math grade 12. So, um, but yeah, that was that was the first one. That's funny. What's up, man? What's going on? That's sick, bro. Yeah. What's up, Dad? How are you? Good, we're good. How you doing, okay? Yeah. What's up, Ma? Thank you. Wow, you're great. Thank you. So great. What's up, bro? What's up, bro? Good stuff, eh? Yeah, so proud of him. Thanks, man. I was just so proud of him, and uh, I was excited, and uh, just a bunch of mix of uh, emotions. Yeah, I love him so much. So excited. Like, I felt like I got drafted, kind of. I was, like, jumping up and down. Yes. Queen grew up in a hockey market in Toronto, so to be able to have the opportunity to go to a, back to a hockey market, playing in a Canadian city, I think is, is absolutely music to his ears.